Bob, let's start with this breaking news today. Moderna says its vaccine is safe and works well in babies and young children, and it will seek authorization for the vaccine in some of our youngest soon. What do you think about this? Well, I think that's a good thing, Rich. I mean, we give vaccines to children of that age bracket, uh, many, many vaccines, as your viewers know, like for diphtheria and pertussis and tetanus, and this is standard procedure. So to have a vaccine for the six months to five year age group is sort of a natural thing for our society. It will protect these little children, even though they're at very low risk of getting severely ill. Nevertheless, when we instruct the immune system early on, it lasts and it lasts for very many, many years indeed. So what do you say to the parent who says, I understand that, but at the same token, if you're telling me that there's very low risk that my baby is gonna have a severe reaction to getting COVID, why get the shot? Well, you don't know whether your baby is going to have a normal reaction or a severe reaction, and that's the problem. You know, I hear from young, uh, uh, young mothers and fathers all the time who have very, very uh, sick children, and they had no idea that their child was gonna be the one in a thousand that would get very sick and wind up in the hospital and in the pediatric ICU. So you simply don't know. We know that there are things called immunogenetics, which are inherited from multiple generations. We know that there are errors of immunity in certain people and certain children after they're born. We need to know who those children are. We need to protect everybody.